97.9, Whittle 5.5, Kiss FM. It's Big Papa in the morning on the Lennon's Jewelers Hotline. WWE superstar, the Funkasaurus, and one of the stars of No One Lives on Blu-ray and DVD combo pack out now, Mr. Brodus Clay. Brodus, how are you? Man, I am, I am tremendous, man. Room temperature. I, I, I appreciate you getting up early for us. I, and, wow. Um, the schedule you got to keep, bro. I, I don't even know how you maintain it. The, the, the travel, the, the in and out of, of cities on a daily basis. Um, how you feeling? You all right? I'm good, man. I'm good. You know, like you, uh, you get used to it. You know, what's funny is when you get time off, you don't know what to do. It's, <laughs> and it's a lot like, uh, when I played, uh, college football and the season's over and you don't have to go to practice. You just kind of sit around and you get real confused. You just don't know what to do. Yeah, your body, your uh, body's not busy. used to your body's not used to like resting and like sleeping in and you know cramming into rental cars and stuff like that. <laughs> the cramming into rental cars that never gets old. My body <laughs> never seems to uh, get that. But uh, <laughs> you, uh, whenever you have too much downtime, your body starts to think. So you get you get used to it. And we're talk- amazed how how comfortable you get with being on the move. Absolutely. We're talking to WWE superstar Brodus Clay and the Lennon Jewelers Hallhine. Follow him on Twitter at Brodus Clay. Uh, talk to me about the movie. I've heard awesome things about it. Yeah, you know, uh, it was uh, it was my first project, and uh, I was real excited to be a part of it. And um, it's a I, I keep I call it a classic. It's an instant classic in terms of like the the style of the horror movie. Is, is real cool. It's like a lot of the, uh, the old school special effects that, that uh, you see in some of the older movies like American Wolf in London and like A Nightmare on Elm Street, which is kind of which is really cool because now what's old is new because everyone gets so used to seeing the computer uh, generated graphics and stuff like that. So it was actually really cool to see a movie that was done like old school and done with film and not digital. So it was real cool. And I, and I like the storyline, bad versus bad, or actually bad versus badder. Um, so it's just different all the way around, just a different, different flick. And I would, I would tell anybody who likes a good, good chill and scare and, a, and a all, like, oh, wow moment to really check it out. Absolutely. No one lives out on Blu-ray and DVD combo pack. Now we're talking to WWE superstar Brodus Clay and the Lennon's Jewelers hotline. Uh, we're on the heels of, uh, of SummerSlam. And um, the only thing missing last night was you on the card. But what what the matches and uh, everything that happened was just absolutely incredible. You know, um, as a competitor, you know, uh, I was frustrated to not be a part of it. But as a as a fan, uh, I got a chance to just I was up in a box and I was watching uh, in the Staples Center, and uh, I just got to say that like CM Punk, Brock Lesnar. Uh, Daniel Bryant, John Cena, Christian, Alberto Del Rio. They just, uh, the, those three matches were just ones that will be talked about, I think, uh, for the next 10 years. It was just amazing. It was what the crowd was just, it was off the, it was pandemonium. It was just a really, really exciting thing to watch. You yep. know, and uh, the only thing better would have been being a part of it, but uh, the fan in me, which will never go away, um, just, in, just enjoyed it and, uh, CM Punk and Brock Lesnar. I mean, they just left it all out there. They they really did. And like, I'm a I'm an old school. Like, I've been a wrestling dork. I, I call myself a wrestling dork. I've been that way since you know, like I was eight years old. So like last night, we, you know, we had a you know SummerSlam party and we we're doing the whole thing and uh, just just a real good time and just you know you know it's one of those uh, people who I, there were people there that don't normally watch WWE and they're asking questions because they're you're not sure of storylines whatever. And there were a couple times where they got lost and entranced in the matches and to see them kind of lose reality for a second is really cool, you know? I think I think you hit it right on the head. Last night was old school, you know, and the guest referee has always been uh, a big part of the, the history of SummerSlam. You know, Jesse the Body, you know, would he count three, would he not, was he on the payroll of the Million Dollar Man back in the day? Um, so, you know, in that main event, you know, Triple H and and everything that went down, um, you just it just brought you back, you know. It just brought you back, and and to hear the reaction of the crowd um, was was pretty cool. It was it was pretty cool. 
We're talking to WWE superstar Brodus Clay, the Funkasaurus, on the Lennon Jewelers Hotline. Follow him on Twitter, at Brodus Clay. And uh, the new uh, the movie, No One Lives, it's out on Blu-ray and DVD combo pack uh, right now. It's got to be like a double-edged sword right now because WWE trusts you enough to put you in their movie, but you're not necessarily getting the, the, the solid push at this point. Like you said, you weren't, you know, you weren't on the card at, at SummerSlam. So it's got to be one of those, yes, everything's going good on this end, but this end could be a little bit better and of course you know when you're doing professional wrestling it's a you know it's you know highs and lows anyway but it's got to be you know tough just from a mental aspect because things are good here but not here and then things flip on a dime and it's got to be frustrating and challenging all at the same time uh you know you're you know honestly you're 100 percent right you know it, it's peaks and valleys and when you're in that valley you really want to get out of it um but, you know, you have to be patient. You have to be ready. Um, you know, I started the 365, the redemption thing. And, uh, you know, I've, I've cut weight. I'm training. I'm taking it like, no, you know, just doing what I need to do and uh, stay in the course. And, and when I get my when I get my chance, I got to just knock it out of the park. You know, um, you always want to be in there. You always want to be in the ring. You want the opportunity to have uh, – Chomping at the bit, you know, and uh, and and yeah, you you're 100 percent right. It is frustrating, and it's frustrating for anybody who's in any not just in, in the WWE, but professional sports or even at work. You want that promotion. You want that. You know, you you want to do everything you can uh, when they do call on you to be ready. So, and that's kind of where I'm at right now. Just uh, I'm not gonna let the circumstances dictate. Uh, how I go about doing things is I'm going to dictate the circumstances. And, and you know, it's funny is I did uh, uh, a lot of meet and greets uh, at Access and stuff, and uh, fan turnout was was really awesome. And, um, you know, I have a lot of support out there and uh, I have a really good following. And you have moments when you, like, you're not in the ring and you can get a little down and frustrated, but then when you're, you know, doing a meet and greet for an hour and the line never goes down and kids are giving you hugs and people are telling you they're proud of you and keep doing what you're doing. Um, it's inspiring, and so you know, step it up and don't. That's very uh, cool. Don't be negative. You know, get it together. Absolutely awesome. WWE superstar Brodus Clay. No one lives out on Blu-ray and DVD combo pack right now on the Lennon's Jewelers Hotline. Um, what's your? Do you have a favorite match or someone that you uh, really enjoy working with and maybe haven't had a chance to often? But do you have like a couple moments where it's like, wow, it was awesome to work with so and so or have a match with so and so? Uh, I really enjoyed uh, the match. Uh, when I got a chance to work with CM Punk. Uh, big fan of his. Um, like the way he conducts himself. Um, uh, only really mix mix it up with uh, Cena once. As long as Alberto and I just got a taste of that. That'd be cool. Um, and uh, Dolph Ziggler, man. I, I, Dolph is the, is the toughest. Uh, he's got so much heart, and uh, I always enjoyed uh, uh, working against him. Very cool. It's uh, WWE superstar Brodus Clay, the Funkasaurus at Brodus Clay. Uh, no one lives on Blu-ray and DVD combo pack out right now. Before we go, this is a quick six, six questions, 60 seconds. Let's everyone get to know a little bit more about you. All right. Let's do it. Here we go. Uh, two shows on your DVR right now. I'm going to do right now. Uh, it would be Dexter, Bright House will stop tripping. And um, a really, really big, big, uh, Game of Thrones guy. Favorite toy as a child? Uh, Godzilla. You're at the bar. What's your drink of choice? Um, angry uh, apple cider. That's what's up. Um, you're you're obviously on the road a lot. You stop at the uh, at the convenience store. What are your go to snacks? Uh, almonds and um, smart water. Favorite body part of the opposite sex? Um, <laughs> all of it. And finally, what is your um favorite toy as an adult? Godzilla. That's what's up. 
Uh, WWE superstar Brodus Clay, the Funkasaurus. No one lives. Blu-ray DVD combo pack. And, of course, you can check them out on Raw and SmackDown and uh, add them on Twitter, at Brodus Clay. Brodus, congratulations, bro. I'm, you know, I, they call me Big Papa because you know, I'm 6'1", and at my heaviest, I've been 450, and I've been a huge fan of WWE. And, you know, congratulations. Keep doing what you're doing, and uh, don't, you know, don't let your head get down, man. Just keep doing it. Oh, I, I will keep I will keep my head up and keep doing it, and uh, you know, and thank you for having me, man. Everybody loves Big Papa, man. Good stuff, bro. I appreciate it, man. It's Brodus Clay, everybody. We're gonna break. Come back, Big Papa of the morning, Kiss FM.